previously. Hey everybody and welcome back to Minecraft Project Ozone. When we last left off it was yesterday for me and we were somewhat getting to grips with our supercomputer. And speaking of which, I'm going to turn around slowly for the big reveal because I think I finally cracked it. Oh, slowly. Oh, oh, oh. It's gotten bigger. Right, so. Uh, you remember before we had one of these crafting storage things and like one of these co-processing units. I eventually made enough to alternate storage, crafting process, storage, crafting process, storage, etc, etc. Turns out that it's not what you need. You need like one of these and then surround it with these. Now we could have had this much thicker but I've only had it a one thick. And... When they're together like this, it's classed as one CPU. So if I condensed all of these into one thing, it's one big powerful CPU, which is not what we want. We actually want multiple smaller ones. So we have this one, we have this one, we have this one, with this, 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 and this. So we've got a bunch of CPUs here, which I've arranged into a somewhat nice looking structure. These ones going up and then these ones are on the outside, which I think looks pretty cool. Uh, but basically these allow us to craft multiple multiple things because the way it works no, I'll get to that in a minute. Anyway, uh, storage is right here in these. I crafted up, I don't know if I did that on camera, the 16k storage and then underneath there is the energy acceptor and the dense energy thing and then around the back is just more cables. I realized we weren't getting the most out of all of these uh, we were only connecting to, what was it, like 23 or so? Whereas now we connect up to uh, more of them. Hang on. Is it this one? Nope. Uh, craft this. Next. We are now connected to... Why does it tell us how many we're connected to? Anyway, you still have one CPU here, look. Now we have a bunch. We have seven of them. I can't remember where we... Oh, there, 63. We connected to 63 of them. Now, another thing to notice is I've arranged these downwards rather than across at this point. And the reason for this, each line across, each row, represents one of these. Now, each of these can access the things around it. And then there'll be one sort of behind it as well. So if I put something to be crafting here, it can use it like these Four. Well, I know there's one more. Let's just say it uses these four. So this one can access these four. And then the next one can access these four. So if I have something powerful here and all of these, I have craft this one to that and that and that and that and that. Because it's all on the one machine, like for example this one, it has to use these four to craft everything. Whereas having the multiple lines like this, it can do... This can start crafting the beginning ones, and then this one can start crafting the better ones, and that one can start crafting the ultimate ones, and that one can do the next ones, and it'll spread out the workload to get it through it quicker. That's basic, just as far as I understand it. Now, in terms of recipes, I have added a few more. So we've got our basic, I'll say our basic, the ones we made last time. Then I added some more things that we might need to be crafting a bunch of, uh, like cables and crap. Then I started adding draconic stuff, and then the basic things that might be including recipes that we might not have, but can easily make, like sticks and planks and chests, hoppers and furnaces and wool and, fern and books and rides, stuff like that that can easily be made. If we need any more, we can always add patterns later. And this is all connected up, and we know how that works, basically. Oh, I'm losing my voice. I've recorded so much, you guys. Uh, food's looking good. We may have some on never starts, but it doesn't matter. This is all hooked up. All right, so one thing I actually want to start on straight away, because the sooner we do it, the better, is I want to tell this to stop making demon steel, which means this stuff's going to start piling up in here, which is fine. That's kind of what we want at the moment. Because what we want is some draconium. Now I'm going to replace one of these in here. Excuse me. With draconium. Because we, we actually need more draconium. So by having that in there, it should spawn some of them. It's not going to be the most perfect system. It's not going to get me crap tons. But it will start... 
Or it should start spitting out draconium. There it is. Right, good. Oops. So because it's spitting out draconium, we're getting more of it. And because there, there's nothing to turn it into, it just sits in here. Otherwise... Although it doesn't have an EMC value, so I don't think it would be consumed. In fact, I don't even think it can go in there. So where is it going to get piped to? Does it go straight to this? Well, we've got 317. We'll keep our eyes open. We're at 317. If we go straight to there, then we're sorted. 318. Okay, we're well, good. Right, we know how that works. Right, we'll just take another demon steel out of here. Pop that back in here. Because it doesn't have an EMC value, it can't go into this. There we go. Sorted, and that shouldn't have messed up. Yep, that's all good. But yeah, we need more draconium. A lot more of it. How much? Maybe double what we've got? I don't know. But we'll get onto that shortly. Uh, in the meantime, we can start doing some more stuff. Now, one of the things I want to be aware of is I'm pretty sure if we get the PC to craft things, or maybe if we have the PC making a pattern to craft things, it doesn't complete it in the book. So we can do some tests on this. Uh, where are we doing? Eta? Eta is what we want. Right. So we want to make a 4K ME storage. Because we're going to wait for all... We're going to basically make all of these. Now, we have already made this. I don't know if it's going to know we've got it, though. We might have to make it again. So 4K ME storage is iron, redstone, quartz, glass. In fact, we can type it in here. 4... 4K ME storage. Needs that. Right, we don't have the one thing it needs, which is one of these. Oh, what do we need? We need a 4K ME thing. Right, can I have one of these, please? Go. Done. Right, so now we can make that. So, is this going to be classed as completed? It is, cool. 4K one. Right, then we want to make the next tier, which I'm assuming is the 16K. Let's go for that. You know what, we can just type this in. Uh, 16K. So we'll probably need one of those. Thank you. 16K storage cell. Oh, wait, on. There we go, it made it. Book. Claim reward. I want a 64k ME storage. 64k. 64. We have. Oh, yeah, I made a bunch. And I made the bunch of these because I was making these 64k crafting storages, which is why I have a bunch. Uh, then I want to make. What do I want to make? What do I want to make? Oh, the 64, 64k storage cell. Done. Book. Claim reward. Hey, we're getting bags for these ones. 256k storage. So it's going to need one of these. That's why things start taking some time. Start. But done. Because we spread them out and it goes across multiples, it doesn't take anywhere near as long as what it used to. K storage, that one. Yeah, let me the wrong one. Ooh, the recipe's different. Flux, dust, crusted di uh, diamonds, and quartz glass. Thank you. Book. That one didn't come with the thing. 1024. 1024. Why do my numbers not work? Sometimes these numbers aren't working. So we need one of these. It's going to need all of that. Start. And then we take a 1024k storage. Done. Reward. Back. 496k. We we Numbers, please. 496k. Next. 
it's that uh, that one. Oh, we don't have it. Did I craft it? Is it still crafting? Oh, it's still crafting. But you see how it's like spread out amongst different things like this stuff up here look as well. Before it was just like centered in this bottom one. Cool. Uh, anyway, that should be... Still not done. Hmm. Now, one thing I neglected to do, but what I can do is actually put like monitors on here and it'll tell me what it's crafting and when. And how much. This is taking a bit of time, isn't it? I was able to check these before, but I can't remember. There we go, we've got a minute and a half. Wow, we've got a minute, because this is what he's crafting up at the moment, look. He's trying to make that, but to do that, he needs to make six of these. To do that, he needs 45 of those. He needs to make two of those. He needs to make 50 more of those. He needs to make 127 of those. He needs to make 360-something of those. So all, it all adds up. But a minute and a half. Uh, as you can see, it's spread out the, um, the cost. Which is pretty decent. So we might even maybe see these in different windows and stuff. Something down there. What is down here? Whatever, that's going. Right, how much draconium do we have? Because we need. I think we need about 700 of it. 368. So it's gone up about 50 blocks in the time it's taken us to craft these up, which you know, is not a lot of time at all. That's fine. It's getting so laggy. I f should I stick down like weld anchors to keep our chunk loaders, whatever they're called, to keep these welding, and then just go set up base somewhere else? Because this area is so laggy. How's our how's our power situation doing? <laughs> Pretty good. We do have a constant drain, so we are in negative powers. But are you seriously not done yet? 10 seconds. So how could we speed this up? I don't know. Uh, there it is. Right, put that in there. Craft that. Fuck. Oops. I made a Starfield creator. I accidentally opened my bag. I don't know what that is. Flame rod. And then this one, yeah, we need to craft it again. I'm assuming if we just take it out of the storage bit, it's not going to work. No. Right, we're going to have to make enough one of these, and these ones are expensive. However, what I am going to do is I'm going to put in the... Two, six, ten, ten, ten. I'll put these ones in up here. And we've made them, we might as well store them in. 4k, 16k, 64k. We've got a bunch more space. And then these ones, I'm going to craft up a bunch of the baby ones, these 1k ones. Because these will be good for storing massive amounts of stuff. And these will be good for storing, like, tools and stuff. I think that's how it should work. See, that one's already full. Now, there is a way to distribute the full stuff to the others. But I, think, I, I looked it up and I didn't understand it. You need to make, like, um... I.O. Port. Or something. Ah. Apply. Applied. Right, where's my machines? Where's my machinery bits? Me chest, ME interface. What? Don't know what that is. ME I.O. Port. And it's not complicated, but I was reading about how it's supposed to work and I. I couldn't understand it very well. But you know, you guys could leave me comments and guess. Ooh. A matter cannon. What is this Starfield generator? Starfield. Ah, we'll throw it away for now. We'll figure it out later. And we have. Why do we have a. Uh, one of those on us? 
Also, we have cubes. Sorry, I'm, put, I'm bouncing backwards and forwards. Desperately trying to figure stuff out. Right. So we need to make one of those big ones. I don't know if we have enough resources for that. I don't remember what it's called. 16384. I'm pushing numbers and it's just... There we go. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh. I have to be hovering over the computer, it looks like. But not here. Here I can do it. And here I can do it. But not in the inventory itself. Uh, was it 16... 10, 24? So I don't know. What am I making? What am I making again? 16, 3, 8, 4. 16, 3, 8, 4. So I did actually put a recipe in it. So I should be able to just tell it to craft that. We still need 2,000 more. That stuff. Oh my god. Right. Uh, Certus. We need to make 2,000 of this stuff. Just make one of these. I think. Alright. Diamonds. Sixty-four, hundred twenty-eight, two hundred fifty-six. So, uh, actually, we don't need that many, do we? Like that should be enough. I'll place my hot bar so nice, like everything. That should be enough. I will then also throw a few more in the machine, purely because at that point, you know, we'll be out, and we need, we'll need them for future stuff. Blood Moon's Rising. Also, I should set it to craft because I imagine it's going to take a while. We have everything it needs now. It's a crazy amount of stuff. Stat. So we should be able to see lots of stuff going on. But it has to go for them steps at a time, though, I guess. How long is this going to take? Eight minutes. Right. Gives us time to get a few more crystals in. Because we still need... This is only going to make us the storage ones. You still need, like, uh, fluid ones and gas ones. And we don't need to go to the top, top tier versions. But even the lower tier versions will still need crystals. I think. How do I manage... How do I keep managing to get lost in my base? Yes, yeah, so I could have just set... I could have set this up a lot better, I think. But A, that would require a lot more knowledge than I have. And B, I like the way I set it up because it looks beautiful. I like... I like the aesthetics of it. <laughs> uh, I think that'll do it for these crystals for now. Hopefully we don't need anything else. Put diamonds away too. I think. And we can remove that stuff. Alright, how is this going? 400 and something. Oh well, right, uh, this. We're working on that now. When we can start doing these ones, we're kind of, you know, it's already doing stuff. Uh, I guess we can start making these panels. These, I imagine these aren't that difficult. It's a panel, some cells and stuff. Yeah, I can make that. In fact, I could probably make that right now. Because we've got the recipe for, I added the recipe for panels in here, look. If I tell it to craft something, and I don't have the stuff, will it then craft it for the recipe, or will I... I don't know. Right, what am I making? ME Fluid Terminal. That one. So it didn't add the panel. 
but I do need two of them. Go. And now I have three. I thought you only said to make two. Whatever. Uh, ME fluid terminal, done. Just throw that back in. Book. I need to make a gas terminal, which is... Oh, just type in. Gas terminal. Right, we don't have sulfur or yellow dye. <laughs> dye. Ooh. Turn that off. Oh, it's a blood moon. Right. I really hope you guys don't mind, but I need to go pick some... Yellow flowers. Just gonna make sure there's no creepers gonna blow up my flower bed. Away we go. So that goes in to there. That makes that. And then we put that stuff there. Done. Get out of there. Uh, book quest done. Look at us. We're doing it. A good bag. Artifact armor, which is for shoes that make us slightly faster. Well, we can never wear armor. Well, not never, but we never would wear armor because we have to remove our draconic stuff, and that stuff is just too good. Book. Uh, we can make a special I.O. and that unlocks these. I think it's where you make like a mini dimension. No, you can store stuff in like a temporary dimension. So like... This building here, I could store that into into a special I.O. port and then take it out and this stuff would disappear. Then when I plug it back in, it would come back. I think that's how it works. Something along those lines. Uh, now, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? I want... Oh, the book. So special I.O. we're not going to use. We're working on this. We can start working on these, but I want to get this done first. Alright, let's make this. We need a wireless access point. I think we need two of those, because I think this needed one as well. Yeah, a wireless access point. Which needs... Wireless receiver. So let's just... Wireless. So we need this. Okay, that needs those pale things. Sure, whatever. I put I did a recipe in it, but that works. And then we need one of these. Oh no, we need two of these. Luckily they do stack, and then we need one of these. I don't know. Wait, wireless terminal. Wireless. What am I making? Wireless crafting terminal. Oh, I need one of those, which I don't have. And an ME crafting terminal. Do I have one of those? If I do, it's not in there. Crafting terminal. I can make that. I don't I have a crafting table? Ah. Can I have... Ah, oh, give me ten of those, thanks. Uh, then I want one of those. Thank you. And then I want that. Done. Put that in there too. So we're getting set up anyway. We're getting this stuff done. Hey, we made one of those. So we literally need now a singularity. But to make a singularity, we need something. Is it in the book? Fish layer, fluid assembler. Right, it's not in here. I have seen it on Yogg's cast, I don't know what it is though. But we do know it's an applied energistics thing. So if we look in here at applied energistics, we'll just look for something. It's like a compactor or something like that, I don't know. Let's look for some machines. Chest. Drive, controller, special IO box, quantum ring, matter condenser, maybe that's what I need. Energy cell, 
Mass condenser. Right, screw it. Let's make one of these. Matter condenser. Done. What does this do? Ah, condensed things into singularities. So it needs 256,000 of something. That's not that bad. 